do I have? We've bypassed that one, that's fine. They're cancelling the Lend Lease. They want all the stuff for themselves. Who could blame them, eh? Do we have any naval bombers? We've got fighters now. This is looking more promising. Close air support we're good for. Naval bombers we're good for. Good. And I may as well put a couple more lots of fighters in training. Right. Okay. We've got improved AA upgrade. So, things are kicking off now. Where do I want to go? The Navy. The, oh, we, we def, well, we need 1940s uh, submarines, don't we? Let's get that researched. We're kind of struggling along there. Non-aggression pact from China. We'll take that one. Naval battle results. I don't really... Oh, ow. Ow, okay. We ran into the whole Japanese Imperial Navy there. That is not what we want at all. Do we have any aircraft here? But they're supporting the army. Uh, that's the thing. What I want, I, I must have some naval bombers that are, are no longer doing things. I mean, I, I kind of need stuff over there. What about, um, I bet you guys over the North Sea have seen absolutely nothing for like ever. Right, I'm gonna, I've got a job for you. You'll see something over here, I'm pretty certain. But where am I going to put them? Uh, I'm going to put them on here. And I'm going to have them over that, because I suspect... If I go over there, they'll probably see more, won't they? I'll put them over there. And we're not going to have very good detection over there. I've not, I've not prepared the ground, shall we say with radar and stuff like that and air bases and we don't have enough troops for this we do at least have a solid army on that border in case these chaps ever have any ideas Ready. it's not you is it it's it's you supply is a bit naff so we, we're kind of doing something about that but uh not a whole lot uh yeah we're gonna try and go up like that if that's the case knock them out. Should really just focus on holding Singapore, really. I, I could probably take half those troops away and just save the manpower and put them elsewhere. That might be better. Do we have... Yeah, should I form... That's not a bad idea. I'm going to form... I'm going to take half of those away. I'm going to form a new army. Put them under this. So that's yes, 12 sir. divisions. Uh, let's make them yellow. And who have we got? Neil Ritchie. I don't really want an armor guy. Planning speed. John. I don't like cautious. Cautious sounds terrible. Merton Beckwith Smythe. Non-combat, out of supply penalties. Am I going to use him for something interesting? I'm going to put Tom Moore in. Jungle rat. Okay. It's it's. This is a. He's not a very skilled general coming in. Now where do I want to actually put these dudes? Because. We should probably hold the port. I suspect this is going to get invaded. Don't know. I don't know is the answer to this. I'm going to go and put them here, though. We're going to try and hold two different areas. Singapore, we have something in there, so that's fine. We'll get those guys out. That should ease the supply burden over here as well, to some extent. Subject may soon raise... Oh, okay, the British Raj is getting very, very close to doing that. That's not what we want. Uh, we are building things. Can we build... Can we build more factories for them? Do we just do infrastructure for them? We've got some projects on, right? I think I'm going to have to get rid of those... Well, I'm going to lose the Indian soldiers one way or another. What's that? Oh, that's okay. That's okay. I, uh, it flipped the side. I suddenly thought we'd lost all those ships, but that is a massive victory. Well done, folks. Well done. That is, that is a superb result. Let's go spend some experience and celebrate. So, Air Force Command. Uh, strategic bombing, which we are not doing at all. <laughs> we really should be. Uh, I need some more military factories to get that done. Right. Britain is coming out of its slumber. We are approaching... The place where we need to be. Vichy France is getting destroyed here. 
Uh, I don't even need to order my guys in to do this anymore. It's it's that good. Yes, it is that good. And we can start thinking about occupying the Mediterranean and going after islands like this, which I think will be great. Although we're going to have to sail around bloody um, Sicily, so that's that could be a bit of a a bit of an issue Hold over it. there. Right, we've got four of these. I'm going to put them in the Africa garrison. Africa garrison currently needing a total of... Oh, only 39? Well, that's damned useful. You guys need some serious training. We'll do it, because we need the experience. Right, I can actually reassign some of those to the garrison over there. So yes, let me take... Sir. Let me take a chunk of those out. Yes. And stick them in that one. And we have just the right amount there. That's excellent. Construction four. It's 43. Any research bonuses? I keep looking for these. I, I'm not, not getting anything new, am I? Not yet. Right, I'm going to take on some better naval bombers. It's ahead of time. But we're absolutely fine for research. So I'm going to enjoy that. Let's plug these guys in. So it looks like we are going to get our ports defended now. We need 44. We've currently got 33. Yes, sir. Uh, let's make sure you're in training. Although Japan might turn up at any moment, so that's not necessarily a good thing. But we're going to try and help the Australians hold all this. So uh, I think this is I think this is a good idea. Oh. Nice. Okay, we've got troops coming in. Ready. We've got troops coming in thick and fast. That's what I like to see. Ready. And these boys which are now currently all in Gibraltar. That's fine. Okay, that's 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 good news. Oh, that's the last yes, of those. Sir. Right, let's throw those in. We have non-aggression pact from Yunnan. Yes, let's accept that. And we have... All right, okay. So our submarines out there now, we can assign them a little role. What have we got in here? We've got destroyers. We are so short on destroyers. These guys are training now, so that's good. Uh, the task force we will assign to the big one. I could try and get another task. We've got a strike force going around over here. Oh, oh no, this is important. Okay, we need to make sure we've got that. We do not want to lose naval supremacy over here. That could be very bad. I think we're dropping because of the bloody um, the escort situation, which is uh, currently absolutely dire. Uh, so I'm going to take a load of untrained destroyers because we we need them, and try and prop up our ailing fleets over there. Uh, that uh, that's bad. That really is quite bad. Anyway, we're still training everything else, so. What can I do there? Can I? What if I put radar on? Because the North Sea, North Sea is kind of important. We do not want Germany coming across there. That would be very bad. <clears throat> I'm looking to see where I can reassign some factories. I need artillery. I need anti-air. I just need more factories. Right. Uh, let's see what can we build and where. A load in Scotland. A load in Northern Ireland. I don't care about other priorities. Let's get this to the top of the list. I really need this to, to go now. And all this sort of stuff. I don't think... Oh, there's some Singapore stuff. Okay. Um, I'm going to actually get rid of a lot of this stuff here. Because I don't think, for the most part, it's needed now. Yeah, that's fine. Let's let's go with that. Let's let's go with that for now. Right. Yes, uh, I hope my strike force is going to do its thing over there because we, we cannot afford to lose that. But if I need more naval bombers over there, then I need more naval bombers. And that's what we shall have to do. Develop the rouge. Okay, that should that should give me some breathing space. No, it hasn't. I was hoping it might. Unless that's gone the wrong way and it's actually done the opposite of what I wanted. British Commonwealth Air Training Plan. Right, screw that. We're now on to 
fortifying East Asia. Oh, what does this do, actually? Cheaper convoys. Oh, I never got the cheaper fighters. That gives me light cruiser model research, which we definitely could do with. And that would give me the research bonus for the tank. That's okay, that can wait. Right, let's, let's fortify East Asia. Manage my subjects. Um, yes, I cannot demote them. Okay, well, that, that's, that's happening. I've used their manpower to my advantage. I can't really complain about it now. So what we need to do, we've got supremacy over the seas here. So let's get the Marines on. Ready, sir. Let's get myself a nice little naval invasion lined up. We're going to go for... Yeah, screw it. Let's, let's go like... Can we go like that? Brilliant. We'll get the Marines over. That should be able to go ahead. I'm going to guess that the Italians maybe don't have a lot there. Might be a big gamble, this. And then we'll throw some troops in. I just need more men. I just need more men. And I need more factories. And I need more men. Uh, let's go... Let's just go full-on 24 divisions. I need more armies for this. Oh, we have some up there. We've got nine... We've got more. Hang on, no, no, that's part of that force. Okay, so where are the rest of those? They're just split up. That's all right. Well, those guys can come over to fight, and they they will fight as well sometime. I suspect they're going to be going into Italy. What's this? Non-aggression pact from China. Except both of those, and we are short of infantry equipment and support equipment. I need to get that. Uh, I need to get that improved. It won't help, of course, knowing that I've just put a huge load of troops into recruitment, but um, we'll leave it there. Right then, Marines. These guys are nearly trained, which is good news. The Marines will go, they'll go fairly quickly. Oh, let's also put these guys onto, it's this one, onto naval invasion support. Here. Encryption. Good. Got that one. I better go research something else. I don't have the bonus for that anymore. There's no point doing that. Is there anything in industry that I can grab that's, that's quite good? I I can see us actually going and taking um, Iraq just to just to satisfy our needs for oil, actually, which would free up some civilian factories. Right, as long as that stays green, we are good. We have some spare aircraft. What do we have? They're still doing pilot exercises. They're good enough to put on to train. We've got some fighters. I'm not going to deploy them straight away. I'll, I'll just put them down near London. Oh, are we getting bombed over here again? Right, okay. Well, we better do something about that. Yeah, we've got enemy bombers coming over and enemy fighters. I mean, we're winning the fight, but... Um, We'll try and sort that out. Finland declared war on the Soviet Union. Finland's out for revenge. Finland does not mess around. Right then, Marines. I'm just like looking forward to this one going now. So this is all good. We, we've got... Um, this is all occupied. There's a little bit of free France left here. There's a little bit here. <laughs> how did... How was this ever a thing? How did that survive? We shouldn't be getting our big fleet in there. I'm pretty sure I haven't told them to go into that big because that looks like uh, a problematic area to fight in. We've got, we'll get surrounded. As in, you know, too much... Oh, actually, no, that's Greece. It was this bit I told them not to go into. Ah, okay. That's fine. Come on. Oh, the Soviet Union's involved now? So we've achieved a huge amount with Britain so far. We have survived till 41. We have, I, I don't think I've done the economy as well, nearly as well as I could have done. Uh, but uh, that's, that's fine, it's, it's enough. We have retaken North Africa well ahead of historical situations. So that's good. 
And we're now looking at pushing on into Italy itself and causing them some headaches. So, so I think we've done pretty well. Yeah, okay. Um, they, they've changed their autonomy. India's changed the autonomy. So we'll see that we've got two armies. Suddenly their manpower is dropped. Their veterans. <laughs> uh, yeah. We would probably need to disband a load of those. Do you know what I'm going to do? They're not in any state to do anything useful. Although I could, I could send them out there and they could occupy a front line. But we've got two armies. Yes, and the same has happened in both. So that should... That should free up some of the equipment. No. So what I might do is bring both of those back. Yes, sir. I don't think they're they don't think they're much use at all, unless they're going to reinforce. What I'll do is I will bring them back to here. Can I draw fallback line? We'll get them home. Yes, sir. We'll cancel all your orders, and then what I might do I don't think they'll reinforce. I don't think there's a the manpower to support them now, so I'll bring them back here. If I disband them in the home country, I know I get everything back that way. You should be aware if you disband things when they're overseas, you don't always get the, the stuff back, depending on where they are. So uh, if you need to break up a unit... Oh, excellent. Look at this. Yes, sir. Look at this. Let's go for that port along the top. There should be... Did I only send two? Oh no, the other guys have just, just arrived, that's, yes, that's fine. We want to try and get there. And now we kind of want to make sure that's... I don't have anything handy to garrison that, do I? <clears throat> yeah, I could have done with something just to throw in there to, to definitely garrison that. The Marines will have to do it. <laughs> What do I have? Wait, I do, I do have, I do have Go that. In. Right, bring, yes, sir. bring Go that in. many over. Because we're going to end up garrisoning two, two places here. Uh, this is just a temporary garrison force. This, of course, will be used to go and attack something. Ah, okay. Well, we've got Go there. In. We're holding the straits. We're going to try... We're going to have to. We're going to have to get that. Yes, sir. I'm just going to make sure we hold both of these. But this is great news because what we can do is we can now stick things over here. We can build some radar on that, which will help our situation in the med. I, I'm pretty sure. And also, we can now put planes on there. Um, oh, well, we might need to build an airfield for that first. So we'll boost that up. I'm pretty sure we will want some AA on there. Uh, that is going to be a bit spicy, I suspect. Right, we've got naval bombers. We could bring these over. Um, I'm going to do this. I think this is going to be very risky. But, I mean, it's what they're there for. So let's see what we can catch. Did my submarine... I never give my submarines out here in order, did I? So you guys should be convoy raiding. And I put them... We want them around here. So there just simply isn't enough of them, to be to be honest. But we're going to go and see what we can find in there. We need more to cover that sort of area. But that will, that will have to do for now. Are we short of... Okay, I can take... I've ended up with a light cruiser in there. I'm not quite sure how I am ballsing this up. The micromanagement hell that this is. Anyway, I'm going to put four. Yeah, four's fine. Let's put them in there as an extra one. Make sure they're all doing that. Uh, it's okay. At the moment, it's okay. We're managing. We're just managing. That naval invasion went off quite nicely. So, those guys, you can take that off. So, what we want to do is... Pile up a massive force and go across there. So I'll wait till these guys come and garrison the port and I'll set the marines to do that job. Okay, that was a, that was a nice little um, steal there, I think. So if we got my Indian troops home... No, not yet. Not yet. We'll see what happens when they get home. Cause I think they're reinforcing. They're, they're basically short of... Uh, 
They're short of manpower. No, they're, they're reinforcing now. So I wonder if they're reinforcing with my troops. My own manpower. Well, let's see. Let's see what happens. If they're able to reinforce, that's, uh, that's excellent. Right, so we should have knocked... Knocked this out. That's... I can't believe there's still some Vichy French units in there. I thought our allies were sorting that out, but it looks like... Oh my god, I'm going to have to do that myself, aren't I? Yes, sir. Right, so... Oh god, I'm going to have to bring these guys over. That's, that's awful. The Supermarine Spiteful. Excellent. Get me the carrier version as well. 305 days for that. I guess I don't have a research bonus for that one. Eh, do it. Or I'll forget. Right, go into production. We're, actually, we're going to spend a little bit of air experience here. I'm so short on dockyards. I need dockyards. Right. So we're going for the Spiteful, but I'm going to create a variant that has more engine power. More reliability. This is 110. That's nice. That will do. That's going to be our first one. Spiteful Mark 1, which is... It is that one, isn't it? Uh, reliability. Yeah, that's the one. Cool. It's nice spending points and stuff like that. Oh, God. I need so many more cannons. Well, we're going to have to get those factories done. We are. That's going to be the way to do it. I obviously need troops to go and sort this out. Uh, let me assign half of these temporarily to this situation here. This this is not what we wanted, but uh, we've got to get him there. We'll give him a temporary commander. We'll get him some experience. We'll get this fixed, and then they can rejoin... Where the hell have they gone? Ready. They'll have to rejoin the others. I'm going to put them in the British theatre for now, and then we'll know where they've come Ready. from. I mean, these guys... How did you get there? Why? Okay, that I don't understand. <laughs> How has one got over there? That's that's kind of weird. Uh, oh, you asshole, Mark. Right, okay, I need to get rid of that. And uh, now I can put those guys. As, as soon as we've got a fallback line, they always come back. Oh, shit. Right, that many going over there. Right, go and occupy that. We're going to take Corsica as well, because of course we can. What was the problem then? Manpower problems? Oh, that's okay. Resistance occupation. This is going to be another one of these, isn't it? We manage the, sorry, occupied territories. Uh, return territory? But there's some of Portugal. No, wait, hang on, that, that can't be right. Uh, let's go to local police force on this one. Because this, this seems a little bit insane. Uh, I don't think this should be a thing. It was given over in a friendly way. Right, we're going... Uh, we're going military governor. Let's boost it all up. I guess there's quite a few places now that we've occupied. Sierra Leone. What about... Hang on. There should be that Italian one. Is that not... Okay, I guess it doesn't count. I was thinking... This? But it's it's not there. Which makes life easy for us. Let's go and choose one of these, shall we? I don't want to have to increase my conscription at the moment. I'd much rather not do that. So I guess the only one... Is there anyone in there? We've kind of lost a little bit of democracy support here. Do we have a democratic reformer? We could sort that out. I don't see there's anything any any better. So, yeah, I don't like having that. I don't think it should have any effect on anything, but I I don't trust the game. So, we will, we will fix that. Okay, so we're going for the Singapore strategy. This gives us three coastal forts, Navy experience. There's the Burma Road. We can... Ooh, actually, that's, that is quite useful. 
That is quite useful. We can hold Hong Kong. Uh, that would take a lot of holding, actually. I think we'll do this one. We'll work down there first. Right, come on, soldiers. We need you in place. Just going to make sure I don't have aircraft doing aircraft things where they don't need to be anymore. That looks okay. Over there. We can't see what's going on over there. Do you know what I'm going to do? This is going to be interesting. Right, we don't need... I'm going to recall the attaché. Because we don't need him there anymore. However, we've got America involved now. We absolutely... Oh, I need 100 points. Right, okay. I should have timed that better then. I will try and remember to do that. It's nice to see that the Greeks are holding on. I mean, this is a tough area for anyone to attack because it's a, it's a supply hellhole for attacking um, armies to come through. And it's, it's, it's pretty rugged terrain and certainly attacking this. So if the Greeks can hold on there. The Italians, I think the Italians might be a spent force by and large. Right, nice. So we've got some of these guys have arrived. It looks like we may have been torpedoed on the way, which would be a, a great shame if that's the case. But I am going to do... Ah! I'm going to have a front line here. And I am going to plan an attack across there. I'm going to see if I can just storm across those straits. Yeah, that's a shame. I, I'm pretty sure we've yes, we've taken some damage coming across there. It is risky. We we do not control the waves, not quite yet. The more ports we can we can gather up, the the better. But um, at the moment, why are you not doing? I have not turned strike force back on. That's so annoying. When you when you cancel the, uh... do you know what? Let's also add it in there. Screw it. Let's also add it in there. Go right up to their mainland. We're going to have naval supremacy. That means we can invade Sicily whenever we want. We can cross those straits. We're going to be good. Uh, let's see. Did we get the force into West Africa? They're not there yet. That's this lot, isn't it? You should all be doing this. Let's see, where, where are they? Oh my god, they're going that way round? <laughs> okay. Okay. That's fine. They'll get there sometime next year, maybe. They've split up. Well, as long as somebody wipes these out, then that's fine. Oh my god, we still have to... The Allies are, are slowly taking these places, but it is a slow thing. Oh, thank god. Military factories. It's like I've walked through the desert dying of thirst and suddenly there's a there's a nice cold pint waiting in front of me. Right, I think desperate times. Uh, it's it's artillery. Let's have another five factories on there. Been eaten up straight away. Are we really out of light tanks? I can't believe that's the thing. I know we're using them in no, we're fine. We're fine. We're using them in the uh, garrisons now. Brilliant. So we're going to assign these boys. Let's get that one on. And then we click that again. And this time we can actually assign ground support aircraft to the Marines. So at the moment, they do have some. Can we click on them and see? <laughs> these have done absolutely nothing. I'm going to disband them. They've, they've done absolutely nothing. Let's get them out of there. They've not been in a situation those like old pre-war bombers they are useless and then the other one we've got of course is uh, some fighters and we are low on fuel that's probably because i've put extra ships to sea i would i would guess have we got submarines we have got submarines excellent we'll put them in the spare submarines box over here oh wow okay yeah, our subs are taking an absolute pasting now. They've just We've just reinforced the load. And we've got three light cruisers, which is excellent. We'll put them up there. And destroyers are still coming on. 
slowly.